Hello, what's up everyone, it's time to do the daily sketch of the week, uh, yeah, let's go right ahead, I still haven't checked the list right now, we'll be seeing that live. <clears throat> Alright, so Daily Sketch Challenge Group Founded 14 years ago Oh no <laughs> Alright uh, um, Monday Thursday Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, here we go. We're gonna start, start with, with the easy, easy one. Monsters, Monsters are always easy, easy to draw. draw. Man bat. I wonder if I can stretch. Since I have more space around the camera here, yeah, maybe we can. I'm not sure how to zoom in. So instead of zooming in, let's just use the screen. Yikes. Not like we needed the space here above, and it's reversed. Can I can I reverse the picture? Mm. No flip vertically. Is the mm, this could be fun, but. It, I like to swap right, left and right. <clears throat> nope. Alright, we're gonna keep it like that. But Alfman, all of but wait. <laughs> so what do you deal with man but? Is that a bat? Is that a man? Who knows? Let's go classic here. Let's go. What kind of face does man bat has? Like, um, yeah, I know it's a face of a bat, but does he have monster teeth?
what we have so far. Yeah. Oh, it's right, we reversed. When drawing one bat, I like to draw weird creatures and stuff. It's kind of like drawing the lizard from Spider-Man. Scientist going wrong, etc. Where's my music? Give me my music back. Mambat! Squee! Squee! Two 
Two Face. Ah, an easy one. Orvident. Where is he? Hmm. For evident, it's about drawing a guy <coughs> and a disfigured guy and mixing them <laughs> at the middle of the face. Sounds easy enough, and it is, it is easy enough. More evident! Where is he? spot to mix the, the, the two designs. So the face is easy. Wait, where am I? The face is easy enough, but the air is always annoying. Orvident, where is it? Arvident!
Next up we have uh, whatever. <coughs> Clarion the Witch Boy. That's a DC Comics supernatural character. Um, See what it looks like. like. I remember the I guy. Remember the guy. Mm -hmm. Clarion. Clarion. And that's a. That's a there's Clarion the Witch Boy and there's a Clarion.
Clario, Clario, the rich boy so far. Boy so far. I'm going to give him the, the, the cat the he always has. He always has. I need to bring I something here. Something, yeah. Ahem. <clears throat>
guys. Let's try to make to draw a cat. <laughs> Let's draw a cat. That's a long cut. After the long cut, let's finish Clarion. In fact, the cat is just going meep. Next up we have uh, the, the thing. thing. Which, Which one? one? Ben, ben Green. Green. The, the thing. thing. It's covering time. It must happen! It must! It must! It's glamouring time! I just saw some reference. I... What? Let's draw her aunt Petunia favorite nephew.
kissing guys. It's that time again. It's glowing time. How many, How many fingers, fingers does, does the thing have? Four. It's all you need to cover. Let's draw, draw the, the, the stones stone on his face. face. That's, That's the most difficult part, part, I think. Imagine, Imagine drawing, drawing the, the, com the, the Fantastic, Fantastic Four, Four comics. comics. Drawing all these um, designs. designs. The, the thing or the, the, the human torch. So many annoying designs to do. And I'm doing that just as a sketch, and it's annoying already. tiring design to do. And I like the thing, I like to see him when he pops up in a story. But, whew. Oh man, I'm not drawing you every day. I'm 
Reading the summary of Frozen Castle. Such a crazy arc.
قدمت اي جوت مونستر ما فرانكن كاسل You got to sketch the entire body if you don't know where you're going. My 
phone is oh hi. Finally. It's waking up. I think. Ah, finally. Man, but, but here we go. Or Orvident. Where is he? That kid from Justice of the Dark. The thing. It's clobbering time. Man, I'd love a good game with the Fantastic Four. I think you can make something good with them. Action pack, but lighter than the fun. Franken Castle. It's not my war anymore. That's this. Here's something for the goblin goblin for the gobble fans out there. And, and suddenly, suddenly we crashed crash through, through the wall. wall. Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> Alright, right. so, so right, right now, now I'm grabbing, grabbing the scans, scans. I mean the, the pictures, pictures I took. I have, I have a lot, lot of streams planned plan for today. today. This, this is but the, the, the first, first one. one. It's watch one of these. Hey, and, and I, I'm, I'm doing, doing this a lot, lot later, later than, than usually. usually. Right. So the, the idea, idea is, is uh, right, right now to finish the daily, daily sketch here and, and some, some scans. scans. And uh, after, after that, that after, after, after this stream, I wanna do I wanna do, wanna wanna do, do a game, game just about the Shiraz art, art or something. After, after that, art stream, stream. and uh, lots, lots of stuff. stuff. I wanna I wanna, I wanna join an art jam, a body art jam. So we have a lot to do. Three, Three streams, streams today. today. Right. So what was I? Oh no. God damn it. No! Stop! Lock. Alright. I was just trying to move my window here. Up in Photoshop. Swap my setup, kind of. I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> oh, stay there. You don't want. Stop moving! Ah! Ah! Phew! Let's see... And...
All right. So, let's start with man bat. Part man, part bat. Not a ripoff of the lizard at all. <coughs> all right, I think we can do this. So this guy, yeah. So what's the deal with man bat? Is he man? Is he bat? I don't know. I feel like I did his head way too big. Alright, we're in Photoshop. We can do anything we want. Let's shrink his face. Ah. Oh yeah. Ah, that's better. That's how you do it. Look, and unlike the lizard, he didn't rip his, his pants. He kept most of his pants. Man bat or knockoff extreme dinosaur street shark. <laughs> I know what he is. He's a ripoff of the lizard. But, hey, that idea was great. Let's do that same scientist gone wrong but sir the batman has mostly normal human enemies eh we can do a monster once or twice but in spider-man the monsters represent <coughs> the wrong paths peter parker didn't take what does it represent for Batman? Eh, it's just Batman in reverse. Man Bat. I don't care. Let's go. Clary, an enemy of Spider-Man, adapt for Batman, come on. Alright. Nice. Who's next? I don't know. Let's go. Let's go. Uh... What was the day? It was the... Twenty-third. Man-Bat. Man-Bat. It stops right here. Squee! <laughs> Arvident. Yeah, he's kind of, I kind of messed him, but uh, I'm going to zoom on his face and it will be alright. Here. Here. <laughs> in case of um, weird drawing, just zoom in. Cut the parts you don't like. Oh, 
Harvey Dent. Where is he? I think he has the opposite problem of Manbat. Manbat had a, a small face and he, are, he has a tiny hand here. Alright, that's enough for me. Save. Face flips the coin. This is how I have to do. The coin lands heads up. Back home today. <laughs> you know, we never seen this in a movie or a game, but I'm sure I, I did see this in a comic once. Uh, let's go home. Batman, you get to be free today. Orvi! Clarion the witch boy which let's admit it was an excuse to draw a cat I think this one is alright. Maybe let's clean here a little bit. Was the world two face Joker rivalry a thing in the older comics? I think every Batman enemy is at odds with one another. I think they all hate each other. I mean, I'm sure the penguin hates the, those two guys. I'm sure Catwoman hates them as well. They all hate each other. Meanwhile, you have Spider-Man enemies making uh, Sinister Six groups and stuff. They team up in Spider-Man. In Batman, they hate each other. Invited them to win my where, where, where is this from? <laughs> and I think Two Face, in most stuff, in most comics, I've seen Two Face with others. I think Two Face hates everyone, he's above them. The Riddler. Ah, no, I can see something here. The, the, no, the Riddler and Joker, they kind of the similar characters, but uh, they waste time making jokey traps or riddles, so I can see them eating each other. 
I'm sure that comes from the 60s uh, show. Now it's time for Aunt, Aunt Petunia's favorite nephew, Ben Graham, The Thing. It's that time again, it's clobbering time! <clears throat> I feel like drawing um, the thing in a comics is a punishment for a, an artist. Alright, you get to draw the, the Fantastic Four, yay! Wait, no, not the thing! All the little rocks you have to do. And finally, Frankencastle, part Punisher, part Frankenstein monster, yay, what a crazy time it was, I, I liked, I liked the comics, the arc, it was fun, it was clearly just an arc, part Punisher, part zombie, whole mess. It was clearly just an arc. They were trying to save his uh, limbs and he had to save the monsters in the meantime. When it was done, he would go back to his life. Eh, that's why comics are better than movies. That was clearly a comic book arc. You, can, you could never see that in a movie, ever. This was the writer and the artist having fun. The only thing I didn't like was that there was Morbius a lot. And I don't like Morbius. He always ruins the comics I read. <laughs> I remember reading a nice 90s Venom comic. And uh, there was weird gob... There were a bunch of goblins invading uh, Los Angeles, San Francisco. And... Um, oh, go goblins and uh, Venom and the, it's a fun story and uh, suddenly Morbius is there. God damn Morbius. Before the memes, Morbius was annoying already. Planet Oak! Yeah! Yeah, they butchered it in Thor Ragnarok. They butchered the three comic book arcs in Ragnarok. We bar barely got the Ragnarok part, then we get to the Planet Oak part, 
and then it uh, ends like the modern Thor from uh, from uh, what's the name of the writer that does a lot of stuff uh, G I don't remember the name anyway he had the part with the Asgardians on Earth I love the movie too And it's too late, they already brought the, the son of Hulk back in the um, She-Hulk show. In the She-Hulk show, there was the, the son of Hulk. I don't know. The movies are a thing. A thing, pun intended. <laughs> but... Uh, that's for everything. For books, for games. The source material is always better than the... The source material is always better than the adaptations. Always. That's right, they skipped... Oh, they skipped uh, his uh, wife thing. Ah, uh, yeah. Alright, we did the sketch. But things are not over for this first stream. Is the plan I'm putting this the plan down here stream one sketches sketches all right stream two short game stream three pinups and bunnies. <laughs> Alright. So, it's not over yet. I have more sketches. Look. I have sketch here. Let's see what this is. I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. wait. I, I'm gonna check out the way I rename the files. Yeah, we're gonna do like this. <clears throat> uh, that's gonna be annoying, but... <coughs> yes. 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 Yep. 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 That is that it. Seven. Okay. All right. Let's try to start somewhere. So this. Is I'm gonna keep this. This is some ideas for my Locust Valley comics you can find on Webtoon and <laughs> Tapas. So, this is just to start the story. All right, I'm gonna keep this. Let's call this Locust ah. <laughs> Two ideas All right Wait, better yet Don't you Yikes That's one sketch down. Alright. 
We have a bunch of sketch and previews for stuff. Here we have um, Venom, Eddie. <laughs> but first, we have a little demon girl. And we're gonna call this Eddie. I want shocky milk, Eddie. <laughs> All right, we're gonna call this Nina sitting. If you don't know her. Well, too bad. <laughs> ah, I remember that was my my lore accurate. These these are sketch from the convention, by the way. This was my lore accurate venom. Fuck you, Parker. This is more like venom. I was saying, he's, he's way too nice in the movies. Eddie is kind of an angry guy. Lore accurate venom. <clears throat> is this alright? Alright. All right, next. Next, <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll get back to that. All right, this is me trying to create a Nork character for my um, fantasy world. All right, so ideas. Doodles, sketches, hair, clothes. Venom is a little bit cray cray recently, and they had to show me the actual panel to prove it. It was once attached to Deadpool. Eh. <laughs> this is my last try with the hair, the pony, the twin tails. I didn't like it that much. The clothes, and I think the final version is. That's gonna be our orc girl. And that's a gobo not to scale. That's not a, a gobo up to scale. She should be a bit smaller, I think. Did we get a name? Oh no, I, I did. So we're gonna have to create a name for her later. <laughs> Or maybe Orket, <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna do this character in color and we're gonna give her a name at that point. And I'm calling this Goblin Girls Orc Girl. Okay, next, next, ah, no, no, wait, this, hey, this was my, all right, this was the first attempt. All right, let's save this one as well. Mm. 
boy, uh, nope. Alright, here's my new gobo. For some reason, I made the new gobo. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know why I came up with this one. I didn't want to make any more gobos, but we made a new one. I remember the story. All right, so here's the store. Here's the lore. I was trying to to redo the the gobo I made with um, Hero Forge. I was trying to to draw that gobo from memory, but I don't have a good memory, <laughs> so it ended with um, it started with uh, trying to remake the. Hero Forge Goblin, and we made a new one. Alright. She needs a name too. I think I had an idea for the name, but I don't remember now. She, li she lives in the trash. Oh no. She is fleshed out or not when things were certain. <laughs> I think I had an idea for the name when we were playing the Shadow Fan game. We're gonna call her. We're gonna call her the fifth Gobo. <laughs> right, that's the name. All one word. She lives in the trash. Oh no. Fifth gobo. Ah! <laughs> Alright, we can get here now. explain this one more lore <laughs> alright this is me trying to have some more characters so I want to make a, a party at least so we have a wizard now and the warrior here who is also a dwarf, but uh, why not? I think I read too much free run lately. The wizard is very Final Fantasy-ish, and the wizard and the warrior here, and uh, that's the fifth goblin again, and some more of that knight. I forgot the design of the knight. I haven't done in, uh, him that much. And uh, a little bonus stuff here. Yeah! Kill all the goblins. Yeah, kill all the go kill all the goblins. <laughs> right. I I want to see this voice. <laughs> right. Is is she on scale here? Maybe not. Alright, next up. I, 
I guess we're gonna call this character character ideas. We'll see. Character I don't know. More character studies. Right. So I uh, I talk uh, about my goblins and stuff, and I noticed I don't have a kobold yet, and uh, they seem popular enough. Everyone loves them. So let's go with a cobalt now. Listen, I'm gonna do what's popular as well. That's show business for you. Right. And what I wanna she has a she has a, a thick tail. <laughs> Right, and I want to do her with um, the TMNT green. Cobalt princess. Wait, maybe if I did something that looks like something. Who is Cobalt princess? I'm gonna check this out. Is that from the princess tower game? Yeah. I see all all the cobalts look the same to me. <laughs> Alright, I see the idea. But uh, hey, that's enough that's different enough, right? And also I wanna make mine TMNT green. What I mean by that? Toys. That, that's what I wanted. Come on. Mind you, there's only so many ways you can draw that edge shape here. Yeah. Where is she? I wanted to have like leaves. You know? I like the idea, like, like a uh, leaf here. You see? Well, I can, uh, I can uh, see it too with that one. All right, I can uh, see it here too. Here's the colors I want to use. TMNT green, grey blue. I wanna use this. <coughs> Just so, so she doesn't doesn't look like a goblin at all. I want the farthest from green. This this is too much like a goblin. And also, this is for reference only. <laughs> and that's when I lost the viewers I had. <laughs> Zooms on a butt. Lost the viewers. God damn it. Oh, she, she doesn't have a name yet too. We will see. Goblin sisters. Cobalt gal.
Oh, and I wanna. She's gonna have eyes like Rouge, Rouge the Bat. Eyes this, like that. Right, next. And next, I was trying to. I was trying to do from memory. I was trying to do the Goblin from the Shadow Fan game. And I couldn't remember. I couldn't remember the design. So I. I ended with the new goblin again. That's a new goblin. To be fair, we could probably just give the kobold a normal name like Tiffany or Asha or something, it will fit. <laughs> so it's a new. Oh, I, I kept the name Cookie. That's Cookie. Alright, that's Cookie. Alright. Gobo, Cookie, and uh, this one is different, she's from our present day, and uh, is her father, the gentle go <laughs> uh, I was on a roll, the gentle gob, I spend no expenses, <laughs> that's my old character here, this is one of my old characters. That's not a dog, that's a platypus. Alright. Go back here, you. Oh, I remember. <laughs> we gentlemen of fortune, that's why we want to be. Go, 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 go. <laughs> And here they are. Look at them. Oh. And that's my daughter, Cookie. Gosh, you're so cringe. Modern day goblins. Look at them. Oh. <laughs> I want to do fun expressions and faces with them. They're my... Uh, Experimental goblins to do weird faces. And finally, a male goblin in my stuff. <laughs> Cookie and Dad. All right, and finally, finally, is this gonna be weird? Maybe I don't know. Wait for it. I'm just looking for a folder here. Uh, character studies. All right, let's call that character. Let's call that character studies. New. My computer is slowing down. I oh, know I opened. All right, I launched something. Yes, what you'd call character studies, maybe. Let's pretend it is. On this side, we have this. Listen, this is just me drawing in a convention. Maybe. And 
and whoops. save let me save all right all right god damn it all right it's saved at least okay we got our sketches we got uh, the sketches stream is done Whoop. <laughs> let wait let me try something here Whoop. okay Whoop. okay all right is this the animorphing magical girl who wields dragon balls chaos and master sword Whoa. And we got so much more planned because I'm going to do the Gobtober. That, that means drawing a goblin a day, starting Tuesday. 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 I'm cheating. I'm already trying, looking for some ideas. This is me trying to find ideas before. All right. So the sketch stream is over. I'm not gonna draw right away because it's gonna be long if I do this. So little break, we're gonna do a game. Um, I'd like to try a game with complex graphics just to have fun with uh, complex graphics. Maybe the dinosaur game, or oh, that's for another day. Or uh, a chillas art I couldn't run before. So we're gonna do, we're gonna play a game and that's it. Oh no. There's an ad on my YouTube video. Stop. Stop. Alright. <laughs> Got them ads. Alright. So we're gonna play a game before drawing. So, or I'm gonna... I'm gonna be drawing all day and uh, I need a little break. So... Game break. What time is it here? Right. In five minutes, in five minutes, I'm gonna start a game, and we'll do the pinups later. All right. If you can run security breach, fine. I need to install security breach. Uh, you yeah, can we, we can we can still. There's a lot of free indie games that look great. So we're gonna play some indie games. Alright, so little break. Five min break. And we'll be back with a game so I can make a pause before drawing some pinups. <laughs> some bunny girls pinups and stuff. Cultured content. Alright. See you back in five. <laughs> 